This is part two of building drawer boxes. In part one, we determined our overall measurements for each drawer box. Now we have to determine measurements for each piece that will make up each box. I'm going to be using the same example. My overall dimensions include two boxes at 25 and 3 eighths of an inch wide, 14 and a half inches deep, and 8 inches high, and one box 13 inches in height. I'm going to want to subtract the width of the material size used for both sides from the overall width. So my front and back pieces will be 25 and 3 eighths of an inch minus that one inch, which gives me 24 and 3 eighths of an inch. The front and back pieces of the drawer fit on the inside. So when you add up the inside board plus the width of the material, you should get the original drawer width dimension when you add it up. My side pieces will remain at 14 and a half inches deep with the same 8 inch height. The pocket holes are made in the front and back pieces. To recap, in this example, I would cut two boards at 24 and 3 eighths of an inch by 8 inches and two boards at 14 and a half by 8 inches. These four boards will make up one box as used in this example, but the formula is the same for whatever size box you're making. Be sure to stick around for part